Okay, so about a month ago, a friend of mine and I took a trip down to Cannon Beach in Oregon. Uh, we just stayed the night over there. Our intent was to go get pictures of Haystack Rock, mainly, at sunset and then the next morning at sunrise. We would have been down there in plenty of time, but of course, as is often the case, I got distracted and I think we both got distracted from the rest of the beach and the way the sun as it was setting was hitting the waves and the sand which is real sand by the way it's fine it's golden brown it's not like stuff you mostly find up here in Washington State so we still got some good shots we just didn't make it all the way down to Haystack Rock I did get a at least one good image of the rock or a pretty good image from a distance. The next morning we left about eight o'clock or so, maybe a little bit before, because it was raining early in the morning. We took the short walk down to the beach and the sunrise garnered some good images, but we didn't go to the rock that morning either. Because all of a sudden we saw this giant herd of elk walking down onto the beach. I have video of it up on this channel actually that I took with my iPhone but I mainly wanted to take some pictures. So I got out my big wildlife lens. It's a 200 to 500 millimeter. And the first images I took were decent. They were, you know, a little bit amateurish. But then I realized, wait, I should probably put on my flash. So I put my flash on and that gave me substantially better images. The herd was about 26 males, females, young ones. I was thinking maybe I would walk over to the other side so I could get pictures of them in front of the rock, but I didn't really want to I didn't really want to spook them. They didn't seem to be too worried about people there. They didn't care, but I just I didn't really want to do that. But either way, I got some good images. I got some nice images of the elk in front of the beach with the water behind them. But I'd say the crowning jewel is with one big bull elk. Now, yes, there's a house behind him because I was on the side where the rock was behind me. But this is one of those images I took when I had my flash on, so it froze the motion really well. The background is nice and blurry, so it doesn't really matter what's behind it. The antlers are nice and lit up. I had seen elk before. It was in their natural habitat. It was up at the Ho Rainforest in the Olympic National Park. But those pictures are not quite as clear and they were a bit more well hidden. I hope next time I go back I can get some really good pictures of the rock at sunrise and or sunset.